Hi guys, it's Rizalka, and we're back with Gabriel Knight 3. So let's continue. And now we're Gabriel. Again. Knight. Gabriel Knight. <clears throat> Alright. Now, things that we need to do straight away is pick up our fingerprint kit, just like Grace did. Good boy, Gabriel. Um, and we might as well look at that note that Grace left us. No. Oh, for goodness sakes. Alright, and we have to unhinge this. Don't tell me it's that locked. That wouldn't do much good. The door is locked. Oh, for the latch is right in front of you, Gabriel. Right in front of you. That wouldn't do much good. Oh, the door is locked. <laughs> Ding. Okay, so now that we've done that, uh, we'll go into the inventory. Give me the inventory. Uh, there it is. Look at it. Sheesh. The woman's already in half a drive and we just started this thing. Oh, for goodness. Weird poem, too. <laughs> Alright, so. It's the weird poem Gracie found in the secrets of the Holy Grail book. <sighs> Apparently he can't read. Alright, Gabriel, I found this poem and a copy of Secrets of the Holy Grail book outside our door. Oh, and if you're going to be sneaking around, don't forget the fingerprint kit. Thank you. Ooh. Read it to me? There's an awful lot of blood imagery in this thing. Arteries, <sighs> veins. It ought to be relevant, but I'm not sure how. Okay, so... Let's see if I can read it. It's a bit small for me to read. It's like, the arms of Jesus are the crow of a cross of Lorraine. Both the blood in the in the, um, in the arteries and the blood in the vein. Both the source of grace and the clear fountain. Uh, the arms of Satan are the cross of Lorraine and the same arteries and the same vein, and the same blood and the same troubled fountain. I thought it was a clear fountain. Who knows? Who cares? Let's leave the room. Yeah, hurry up. Oh, monsieur. I thought all the guests were out this morning. Mm, oh, they were. hey there. Um, Roxanne. Oh, hello, <laughs> I decided Roxanne. not to go, but don't mind me. Carry on. Yes, monsieur. <laughs> yes, monsieur. Ooh. Alright, so. Wait, that's our room she's going to. Where are we? Okay, so you're waiting there. Well, we don't need to get into our room, so that's alright. <sighs> have to wait for her to come back. Is there anything I need from this? I doubt it, but you never know. What do you think about it, Gabriel? Yes? No? Maybe? No? Okay. We got some sheets. Take some sheets. Wait, where are you going? Why are you doing that? They're right here. Okay, thank you. Doesn't look like there's anything I need in there. Ah, for <laughs> Come over here. Get out of her way while she's... Come around here. Okay, so now we just have to wait for her to leave. And then go into Amelia's room. Alright, here she comes. She's gonna close my door and lock it. That's very efficient of her. Alright, so she's gonna go in. Take some sheets. I can't. The cart's blocking the door. Okay, well, we'll wait for her to move the cart. Because she's gotta get some things to go into the bathroom.
Yep, see? Alright, so. She's going to close the door over, but we are going to put our eye on it. So basically when she goes off into the bathroom, that is what we're going to unlock. The dumb waiter. So next we have to wait for her to yet again move and then go into the ladies room. It's going to be a bit different when we get to the ladies room. Oh, well this is Madeline's room actually, not, not the ladies, the ladies are next door. <clears throat> yes, they're not home. I'm the only one who's around, for goodness sakes. Alright, so here she is. watch her do her work. You came quite far in, Gabriel. But oh well. <laughs> like she's not gonna see you just standing there. Monsieur Knight, what are you doing here? See, look, she was in looking in your direction. How did she not see you? She's a fool. Okay, this one's nice and easy. We just go outside. Wow, if she'd been a second sooner, we would have been caught. Not really. <sighs> yep, there she goes and we exit almost immediately. All we have to do here is make sure that the door is unlocked. Okay, so we're going to do the same thing for this room as well. Maybe a little boring, but it's definitely needed because then we can go ransacking through their rooms. Just what we always wanted to do. the girls room exactly the same they should be mirroring each other not exactly the same but it makes no sense I'm not gonna argue with it I'm not gonna argue with it how hard would it have been to just make everything up not make everything opposite but tell the room to flip its dimensions not very hard at all it would have been like simple but no, they couldn't even put that much effort into it. <sighs> Ciara, you are lazy. Okay, so she's locked this door as well. Lock. <laughs> 